It is time to plan for the week of the 8th through the 14th in my catch-all planner, and we have got a lot to get done. So this week, I am coming back to the Kauai Hawaii Deluxe Deco uh, kit. Um, I'm hoping to use the rest of this up this week. I have a lot of to-dos because we are getting ready for Fame Conference. And um, so one thing I did off camera, and I'm, I'm kind of enjoying this. I'm kind of using this. I don't typically decorate it, um, but I just felt like it. I had some conference to-dos and I have other things I want to get done. So I was like, you know what? Use this as a brain dump so that when you go to plan and you're trying to decide what days you want to do what things on, you have it readily available. So that's what I did. Hi, Jules. I am filming this on Sunday the 7th. We are hoping today is the last day of fireworks <laughs> in our area. I just have given Jules her special special treat and she is definitely sleepy so i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna put these this one up here to cover up there do i want to do that i do i do wait <laughs> do i i also have these are some two dollar Tuesdays because I want to do the I think the blue I like the blue I don't know if I like it with the pink I think I think we're gonna commit we're gonna commit because I can always use the orange or a different color let's move it up there So this week, I'm really focusing on a, a couple different things. Obviously, fame conference stuff. I have to get things ready to go for that because it's also our annual in-person board meeting. Um, and I'm also like starting to really focus on... Oh yeah, that's fine. We can do this. Um, planning my leisure activities. I'm trying to practice this in July when it's a little less stressful to do. Um, there's not as much going on. But also planning out, okay, here are to-dos that are like, I hate to use the word productive because leisure things are productive too. But when I'm talking about leisure things, I'm talking about it from the perspective of the book Digital Minimalism. You've heard me talk about that before if you've been here. If you haven't been here, guess what? We're going to be talking about the book Digital Minimalism by Cal Newport. Um, so where basically it's activities I'm doing so I'm not um, scrolling on my phone <laughs> too much. Like because some of the things I do in life have to do with social media, like YouTube. Um, obviously there will be some scrolling, but you know when you get into that mindless state and you just are going, why am I, do you ever sit there and go, why am I still doing this? I have, and I don't like that feeling, so <laughs> I want to make sure that I do something a little bit. Maybe we do the pink one. Um, that I am actually planning for, does that look weird? Maybe? What if we put it here and we moved the this week down? Or what if we did it this way? We're going to try that. Let's try that. Yeah, we're going to go with it. So planning leisure activities so that I'm not mindlessly scrolling. And I'm doing activities that are good for my mind, body, heart and spirit, which is a Franklin Covey thing slash Seven Habits of Highly Effective People. Some of my favorite books. Speaking of which, I gotta show you guys my book journal. I haven't done that in a while, and now that we're into quarter three, it would be a great time to kind of be like, hey, let's look at my book journal.
I don't have a lot of appointments this week. Like the week itself is pretty open, which is nice so that I can get those, as I like to say, I can get those to do's to done. How cute are these? They're so cute. These kits from Exo Mama Plans come with a lot of stickers. It's one of those, like, if you want to do a no white space spread, you can totally use the whole sticker kit and you'll be good to go. If you want to do, I'm going to put the next week over here. Like that. Um, if you want to use it for multiple spreads, you're going to have that option too. I kept these guys. I still have him. He's a, a delicious treat. I wasn't going to do the delicious treats, but let's see. All right, so we've got these yellow. What if I put, I didn't think this there. I'll put this little header box, little header right down here. Can I lift him up a little bit? Just so that he kind of matches. Just a little bit. And my fellow teachers out there, are you already in brain dump mode for the new school year? Because I am. I need to start getting the thoughts out. Get the thoughts out. Um, so I have, I can cut these into thirds too. And I grabbed a couple other stickers. I don't think I'm going to need them. I think I'll be great the way I am right here. I think, I know, he's crooked. It's fine. We're not going to worry about it. Um... We have to clean. I'll put that here because I like to make this my cleaning list. Let's do that. Let's do that one first. I think I have any dots on here though. Hmm. Sometimes there's too many icons for me though. See, because there's more clean stuff. That's okay. Better to have more. It's fine. Um, maybe I'll use the bullet points for this one because I'm going to use the checklist for something else. These are bullet points from Coffee Planet Mom from our tropics. She is not open. I chuckle because I was just uh, commenting on my friend Gail's video because she was using a kit from Coffee Planet Mom and I was like, oh, we both always sound so sad when we have to say, but she's not open right now. <laughs> I'm sure she is living her best life, though, because, yeah, all of the things. So specifically, bathrooms. I want to I want to focus on the bathrooms this week, so I'm going to put those with three dots like this, and then I'm going to change the color dot for the other, like, big thing I want to do, which is clean the washing machine. Aren't we all excited? Yay, adulting. Hey, give me that bullet point. So these three are going to be for the bathrooms. And over here, I think I will use kind of the orangey ones. The orangey pinky ones. Maybe. Whichever one wants to let go. Who wants to let go today? Who does? <laughs> Sweet baby girl. Miss Jules is asleep under my chair because you know actually maybe what I'll do if I can get them to let go is I'll put three on this side that are for like other like other cleaning stuff like this is mainly bathrooms that's cute gives me a little little extra stuff right there all right decorative boxes and checklist because like I said I want to do I want to do the I want to do the thing um okay we've got this I also want to use these guys so we'll figure them out I think the delicious treats just gonna go down here because he's kind of the odd man out I mean I'm sure you can get a snow cone at the beach oh no you're in crooked let go he's pretty sticky too Um, this is where I, I think too hard about how to make it look pretty, and I should think more about how do I get things done. 
And that's sometimes a downfall of decorative cleaning. But in the end, it's going to be functional. And that's really all that matters. I don't know why I'm shaking the sticker. This is undo. It helps you be able to remove a sticker and place it back down. Because I should have formed it this way. <laughs> should have gone. This is where we're going here. That's better. Thank you. And I think I will do this one in the notes section. Because why not? And I'll cover up notes. This guy. You can just barely see him, but I'm going to put the dinners. There's this dinners. Is there another one? And another one. Uh, just this one. We will use this one. Just put him right do it like that but that looks weird I'm gonna put them down here dinners okay how do I want to divide this up important to do's and leisure activities because most of those are gonna be in the afternoon I think that's what we'll do so maybe we put the these guys we have one two three four This one here, and then I want the other wave one to be in a different spot. One, maybe we just put him down just a little bit. Two, leave Wednesday open, question mark. Thursday. No puppy on Friday because we all know I love the puppy dogs. And then I can put my checklist down. I do have a weekend banner. Again, coffee planner mom. Sad faces. <laughs> and I think we'll put him down the middle because we have everything else going down the middle and it's crooked but we're going to leave it because we can because we are in decision fatigue at the moment I'm guessing so let's do the things that are to do oh let's put there is one one appointment I should make note of so let's do that with this box and it's on Thursday that's in the morning Tuesday, I smile. You can't see my smile, but I'm smiling. We'll use the other box. It is my husband and I's eighth anniversary. Yay. All right, so I think what I'll do is the, should the leisure activity get a box and then the to-dos get, the to get a checklist? I have one, two, three. Four, five. Oh, we have plenty of boxes if we want to do it that way. So leisure activities, let's use the little boxes. So we've got this one. Now, when I say leisure activities, there are a lot of things that could mean, right? Lots of things. Um, it could be a... Use, let's use this one because he goes with the sandy one. Um... Like, cause I consider my tonal workouts leisure activities, but I'm not counting that with these, cause I've got a pretty good, a pretty good um, routine going on with that. The green one here. Um, I'm talking about playing my cello or practicing the piano, knitting. Um, Things that I can I kind of do downstairs with my puppy dogs on the couch, snuggle puppies and all that fun stuff. And I did talk about this a little bit in my goal setting um, 
planner. And then Sundays, I feel like should just kind of be like chill days. Like if I get like chill. Reading goes in here, although I have a pretty good routine with reading as well, but I digress. We have some to-dos. I can use the must-dos as well. So let's do the yellow on this one. Put that there. might have to lift the eight up just a sc oh maybe not maybe not oh he is lifted up a little bit <laughs> so to do there let's see Lee, can i use a piece of you i just need to use a piece of you do you guys have any important to do's coming up where'd my scissors go I did clean, and that's a problem sometimes, haha. <laughs> because I get ideas when I clean. They're not always the best. They're not always the best ideas. So Kel Newport also wrote another book called Deep Work, and that's kind of what I'm viewing these to-dos as. Like in the morning, this is where I'm going to do my deep work. Um, I need another dip. Maybe I'm out of those now. Ruh -roh. That's okay. To do, let's do the must do. Ha ha ha. It's kind of like the same thing, right? Put this guy down here. And then some of these are going to move around. Mm. Let's do the blue one. I'll probably need two of these. Move this one here. Oh my goodness, I hear you little bugaboos. I'll put this one down here. Oh, I can put him up here. Green one's gonna go down here. Get these down. And then I'll put the other pink one right here. All right, and then I can find the other. I can do this to do with this guy. Or this guy, this guy. Let's do it with this guy. So, yes, it's fun to decoratively plan, but in the end, you really do need to make sure that it's going to work <laughs> with, with the actual things you need to get done. Let's go with, don't forget. Let's put that one here. Don't forget. Do reminder. And after that, I don't have another to do unless I'm missing it. These are all to go. I have a little like, I have a little pencil. We'll use a little pencil. Like it's checking it off the list. There we go. Yay. <laughs> Just getting it done. That's what we're doing, friends. I think I'm gonna use these little icons here. Because why not? Because why not? Oh my goodness, there's all these little dots that I didn't even notice. That's gonna be part of the decoration because we can. Alright my friends, so tomorrow I'm going grocery shopping. I never use this one, so. But I'm excited to go grocery shopping because I got a new meal that I want to play make. Um, we have dentist. We'll use this guy right here. So if I look at this sheet real quick, so 
Um, I've got parent to do's and conference to do's. So I think tomorrow we're gonna work on the year in review. We are going to print out blood work results for the folks. And what's another good to do that I can, let's do, will we have time to do bathroom tomorrow? I feel like that. I feel like tomorrow would be a good bathroom day. Oh, if I'm going grocery shopping, probably not. We'll move that to a different day. Um, for right now, we'll leave that there. Here, we're going to work on MIDI reports, although I think I'm just about done with that in my slide. I know what that means. I it's a hard thing to explain, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna try to. Um, oh, I do want to do floors daily. I noticed the other day when I was keeping up with that that man that makes a huge difference on the downstairs. I don't get to the upstairs every day, but the um, downstairs is like not hardwood hardwood. You know what I mean? Um, and when I just do a quick sweep of it. Man, it makes a difference. I need to try and keep that up in the school year. Okay, so after that, what else we got? Um, membership things. And then Thursday will be um, historical archives. Let's look at parents to do is we need to um, update med notebook, update med notebook. This is where we write down our questions. It's more of a journal. It's like my, um, if you see the series where I use the composition notebook, that's actually what I use as a med notebook for my folks. But this time, because the appointment's on a day where I cannot take my mother, it is my sister. So I got to make sure it's ready to go for her. And life is good. Okay. Some of these things might not happen exactly on these days. Like, we might write down questions for the doctor on a different day. But I just want it here, so... Questions for doc. And then... Fame loose ends. I feel like that's good. And then in there, there will probably be some other things. But those are the big to-dos that I want to get to done. I'll leave this part open. As far as... As far as... um, What's it called? Um, leisure activities. I want to knit. I want to really focus on knitting at the beginning of the week. And then I think Thursday would be a good cello day. And then I'll leave the other ones open for exactly what I want to do. Yeah. And I'll fill out my cleaning schedule, all that fun stuff. So there you have it, friends. You've got pen today, too. Now, here's what happens with these stickers. These are what will go into my planner my little planner notebook, not this one. This one stays here. Um, and I'll use it either in my journaling um, when I want to add a little extra pizzazz or on these brain dump pages when I'm like, you know what? I want to make this brain dump page look pretty. Let's add a few stickers. So I'm starting to do that. So that's where these guys will end up going. Goodbye, sticker pack. Um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. And I will catch you all in the next one.